The coast is an important resource, both economically, environmentally and sentimentally. Because of this, there are large amounts of infrastructure built on coasts, such as residences, industrial land, parklands and many more uses. Building so close to the coast destroys the natural processes of the beach and dunes, so if left unchecked, development on the coast would be damaged in large storms causing poor quality of the infrastructure and lost capital. To combat storm damage, we can engineer infrastructure to slow or stop erosion and even reclaim land from the sea. These structures can increase investment security and bring growth and wealth to the beachfront. In this video, we'll explore coastal management engineering. Groins are a coastal management solution that increase the width of beaches, thus protecting coastal infrastructure from erosion. A groin is a man-made peninsula of rocks or wood stretching out to sea from beach. Groins work by slowing the longshore current, causing sand to deposit along the length of the groin, widening the beach and slowing erosion. If a beach is wider, it'll keep lo f local infrastructure safe in a storm, and with the extra beach acting as an ablative layer during a storm. These, however, have disadvantages. Groins are often seen as ugly and very costly, with one groin costing up to $50,000. Groins also disrupt the local ecosystem. This means groins are, are only used where vital infrastructure lies, such as high-rise buildings and unstable residential areas, prone to large storms. Seawalls are a vital part of coastal infrastructure. They are different to groins which are built only perpendicular to land and whose purpose are to be sand traps. The purpose of seawalls, also called breakwaters, is to break the waves coming in from the ocean to protect shipping, infrastructure from the full force of ocean waves. Seawalls are often made from piled up rocks or concrete. Seawalls can be used to create shipping lanes and to build artificial harbours to create calm waters for anchorage and portage of vessels and safe harbours for recreation boats. An example is Ulladulla and Eden harbours on the south coast of New South Wales. They can also be used for land reclamation to create areas for new industrial land or housing as seen in Florida and the Gold Coast in Queensland. Through coastal engineering we can ensure security foster industry and sustain our environment. Seawalls and groins are two examples of this.